Hi, welcome to the boardshop.co.uk surfboard review. Today we're looking at a new Sharp Eye Stroke Surf Tech board, the Disco Cheetah. So the Disco Cheetah is the latest in the collab between Surf Tech and their amazing Fusion E2 epoxy construction and Sharp Eye surfboards. The Disco Cheetah is based on an older model called the Disco, which was a performancey type shortboard. The Cheetah has a little bit more volume, a little bit more float, more stability, better wave catching, making it more of an all-rounder for um, everyday conditions as opposed to a performance board for better waves. So let's have a little spin round. Um, nice and flat through the middle of the board, enough nose rocker to get it turning, pretty flat through the tail, a little bit of lift, but um, you'll see the slightly domed deck and the slightly pinched rails. So the volume carries through the middle of the board, up under the chest and the panel zones, but it's thinned out a little bit into the rails to give you some performance and ability to turn. Set up as a five fin, uh, this one's FCS2, which is how they come as standard, and you've got a nice single concave running into the fins and V out through the tail. <coughs> it's a very nicely put together board, good in proportion layout, and it's gonna be a board that will go in anything from thigh to probably a little bit overhead. Perfect for sloppier, weaker conditions as well. As I said, it panels well with that volume under the chest, gets you in relatively early. Um, <clears throat> not the most high performance board in the world, but for the average surfer, when you want a board that gets you in, keeps you a high wave count, and that you can get it turning and also progress your turning and make the most of average and then the odd better condition, it's a really good option. Um, <clears throat> Sharp Eyes boards, as you know, are served by Toledo and a host of other top end surfers. This is a board that filters down from their feedback for a more average Joe surfer, people like me, in fact. Um, the construction, the Fusion E2 epoxy construction is frankly about as good as it gets epoxy wise. It's a stringless epoxy blank um, and it uses the carbon strips top and bottom as the um, in effect the stringer to give you the um, the flex and the even flex and the performance that you'd expect from an epoxy board. The great thing about epoxy of course is that the memory stays the same forever it doesn't wear out like PU does and back in the day when epoxy boards were chattery and you couldn't bury a rail those days have gone this, this kind of epoxy is far closer to PU and much much nicer to surf with the added benefit of course that it's way more durable and nice and light as well. The other thing that we really like about this construction, this epoxy tech, is that the core that they use, the foam core, is watertight. So if you hold the board, you don't have the panic of having to get out of the water immediately like you do with some other epoxy brands because the water will not penetrate the core and then you won't have that whole thing where you've got to drain it for three days before you can seal it up and repair it. You can use a standard epoxy repair kit, get it sealed up and get back in the wave straight away. So if you're looking for an all-rounder, a one-board quiver to deal with anything from thigh to a little bit overhead, and you're looking for durability with performance when conditions turn on, the Disco Cheetah is a really, really good option. Um, Sharp Eye is going from strength to strength. Servtech are once again at the forefront of epoxy technology, so it's a marriage made in heaven. Maybe Devon, if that's where you're headed. Um, there it is, available online right now. Uh, as always, you can trade an old board against it, use our 0% finance. Any questions, any more information, you know where we are. Thanks for watching.